Today at the We Rent shop, we're prepping the Audi S4 engine block for teardown and inspection. This car has a 2.7 liter twin turbo V6 engine. The cylinder heads have been removed and reconditioned, so in order to continue, we need to separate the engine block from the transmission and get it up on the stand. The powertrain came out of the car in one piece. To separate the block from the transmission, you have to unfasten all the bell housing bolts. There are a few around the perimeter of the transmission. There are also a few at the bottom. To access these, I'll unbolt the engine mounts. Then I'm going to string a chain across the block with two head bolts and use the engine crane to give it a lift. Now I can get underneath and remove the sway bar assembly and this lovely subframe. The bottom bell housing bolts are now on the way out. The key here now is to make sure the engine and transmission are in line with each other. The transmission input shaft is centered in the clutch splines, so maintaining the proper angle is key to getting it all apart. Before I bolt it up to the stand, I want to remove the pressure plate, clutch disc, and flywheel so I have access to the rear main seal. Mate the engine to the stand by bolting it up to the swing arms and you're ready to go. 150,000 miles on this engine and I could still see the factory crosshatch. What do you think I'll find when I go deeper?